Welcome back everyone to more of Neo. So the only thing left to do in this area is to kill the boss. So let us quickly check if we... Okay, no, our Ayakamori is not charged. So we'll have to fight these guys to charge it. Because I want to go in with Ayakamori charged. I don't want to go outside because that's where the fire thing is. Instead, we'll fight the guys inside and charge it. Okay, I can only charge this with really fast, but I don't know how well she will handle the uh, how long she lasts because all the spirits which charge faster they don't last longer thank god you didn't get me no i don't have and i put all oh shit it broke my key i put all warrior of the west uh, gear but that's why my key regeneration is pretty slow come on dude die all right so we still don't have full you know what let's change back to less than um, 70% because our key regeneration became pretty slow um, okay so we take care of this last spider all right now we heal and we go to the boss room Moment of truth, how we perform. There she is, the vicious spider queen, Juro Gumo, I think her name is. She is not very difficult, but I don't know how much difficulty we will have here. Oh no, she broke our key. And we have slowed down. Our key is not regenerating. Now she will start her dance. Elixir. Man, we are getting killed over here. Ayakamori! Save the day! Oh no, she's not dead yet. We have lost Ayakamori. We have taken care of her. Now Ayakamori did not last very long. So this was the first attempt uh, we have taken care of her. 
middle stance is also pretty nice. In fact, all the stance, stances have their their advantages. Uh, let's quickly check if we are missing anything. We want to pick up everything that we can find because the, in this game you will need that. So let's move ahead. That was a awesome fight. <sighs> Heart pounding, but not very difficult. That's how I like my boss fights. Who are you? Let me make you tea. <laughs> That's green tea, is it? I don't like green tea either. <laughs> so he'll give that bill to William and now we'll be told his story. <laughs> so was he the spider or he was the person that Nobunaga probably killed? Danjo. It was Kuri, spider spirit. That's awesome. We'll, we'll start if we have enough stats for it, we'll start using it. If Master Naomasa recognizes you, so so too do I. So Tori has has come around. Lord Yasu has departed Edo on his campaign to destroy Uesugi. He should just be arriving at Kyoto right about now. I suggest you go and join him there. Hanzo, you'll forgive me if I choose not to accompany Sir Anjin. So they have started calling him Sir Anjin. My heart simply couldn't take it as they say the clever avoid danger. <laughs> yeah. Tori, you are a wise man. Alright, so we have completed main mission Spider Nest Castle. We have found all Kodamas and now the Battle of Ohashi, o Ohashi Breeze open, uh, opens up and the Disappearing Ranjatai. So we'll do the Disappearing Ranjatai first which, and a second main mission Falling Snow has opened up. So in my first playthrough I am currently in Falling Snow. So what I'm planning to do is I'm planning to stop that playthrough and I will see the rest of the game while recording. Um, so right. Uh, the disappearing Ranjatai. Oh, that gives us a, a dual katana of fire. Awesome. Um, and this one, which is quite tough, although it says mission level one, <laughs> uh, we should laugh at it because when we reach that, we'll see it's not mission level one. The interesting thing is now a new menu item has opened up here. It's called Hidden Tea House. So, are we online? So, first thing first, are we online? Yes, we are. So, what you can do is you can actually join a clan here and you can also trade. You can trade items uh, which are a little uncommon, like with 800, you can actually trade Book of Reincarnation. Now, I have currently a glory of 1758. How you can get glory is by killing revenants. Um, so you can also basically transform yourself into Hattori Anzo. You can buy swords. Uh, on rare occasion, you, you will find uh, exotic equipment. And uh, you can also buy some 
Chisters, that's awesome. Hmm. Okay. That is the clan battle that's going on all over the country, all over the world. Um, who is ranked highest? Toyotomi, definitely, because Toyotomi has a maximum number of people. But it actually divides into groups of red and blue. So you can see blue is kick no red is kicking the ass of blue because I think more people have joined red so when they defeat yeah Toyotomi Toyotomi is uh, is uh, red Date is red Kawa is red Lee Satake man there are so many clans so we will go ahead and join red let's see I want to know more clans Okay, he doesn't talk, it's just text that show up. Speak to Donzo. Why can't I join a clan? He actually didn't ask me to join a clan. I don't know why. Transfer, what is that? So, uh, Tokugawa, Toyotomi, each of them give you some kind of buff. So, Toyotomi has the most useful buff, that's why a maximum number of people have joined it. Um, clan analysis. The Toyotomi clan skillfully exploited the chaos after Honoji incident, successfully consolidating all of Japan under their control. The most important clan leaders were Toyotomi Hideyoshi and his son Hideori. As a retainer of Oda Nobunaga, Hideyoshi's astonishing military prowess saw him rise quickly through the ranks until he was entrusted with pacifying entire regions. After Nobunaga's sudden death, the Toyotomi clan absorbed Oda clan's old retainers and realized the dream Oda had been unable to achieve, achieve conquest of the entire nation. Hideyoshi ordered land service and sword confiscation that greatly stabilized the political situation. But after his son Hideyori succeeded him, conflict broke out between two factions with the clan's retainers with disastrous consequences for both sides. The Toyotomi family crest Gosichi no Kirimon is known as 57 Pau Paulonia. Paulonia. I don't know what that means. Probably a plant name. A reference to the number of flowers of each each branch. Okay. 57. Hmm. An imperial design, it was granted to Hideyoshi by the court. So basically like uh, you already belong to, okay, so I can choose even on my other playthrough I chose Toyotomi and it applies to this one also. Um, let's visit the shrine ones, we are at 31,000, uh, how many items do we have? Uh, we definitely use the Master Ninja's Lock, Master Samurai's Lock. Do we have a Master Onmyo Lock? No. No, it doesn't look like. Small Spirit Stone 1, Spirit Stone 2. That's it. That's all we have. Uh, so we are nowhere close to actually having enough Amrita to, uh, to level up. So I think that's, that will do for this episode. Uh, this is mainly the boss fight and then some some stuff um, at the end uh, we don't have anything else we can use but we definitely have some skills and especially in Onmyo I I'll have to increase my magic up to 10 it's 9 so I'll have to wait till the next time we level up and next time I should level up magic up to 10 once we do that we will have to come back and do this dojo mission then we'll be able to get slot so that will do in the next episode hopefully we'll get enough amrita once we once we uh, kick this one out the disappearing ranjitai that has a shrine also and the the two symbols at the same level at the submission text is basically the shrine and tori gate basically the tori gate ones you can take someone with you to to go and do this mission so we'll do that in the next episode hope you guys are liking it i'm going to take this game slow but i'm going to still try to finish it 
it gets too tough towards the end i know that but let's see if we can do it hope you guys are liking it if you are give us a thumbs up subscribe to our channel if you have not and i'll see you guys in the next video game changer x out